Hi, this is CJ Mosley with Eskimo Books and More. I'm going to show you today how to print a media mail shipping label from PayPal. So first thing you'll do is um, you'll need a PayPal business account in order to do this, which is different than a PayPal personal account. If you only have a PayPal personal account, this will not work. So you'll need a PayPal business account. And I use this uh, in a lot of aspects of my business. If I have a, a party guest and a Facebook party, who earns free shipping, I'll reimburse her through PayPal. Or during booth season, I use, so you do the PayPal here, which is PayPal's equivalent of the square. I like having all of my um, various aspects of my business kind of streamlined into one um, program, one account. So I've enjoyed uh, using PayPal business for that reason. And another perk of PayPal Business is that you can print media mail shipping labels, which I periodically give away a free book during a Facebook party. And just a busy mom, three small kids, we have school, and I uh, just really need to leave my house as little as possible uh, for errands, and uh, no one wants to stand in line at the post office anyway. So this allows me to print that from home. So the first thing you'll do is log into PayPal. You'll click on Tools, which I've done here. You'll scroll to the bottom and you'll see PayPal Multi-Order Shipping. So click on that and this website should automatically launch. For whatever reason, if, it's, uh, if you do not see this screen, um, it is probably because your pop-up blocker is on uh, through your web browser. If you do not see this screen up here, you'll need to um, Disable the pop-up blocker on PayPal website, and usually, you just, if you'll just look kind of in the upper right-hand corner of your internet uh, browser, you should have the option to allow pop-ups for this particular website. So do that, and this should um, automatically come up. So then I'll hit Create Label and uh, Shipping Details. I'm shipping a media mail book, and I'm going to use a package for thick envelope, and I usually set it. Keep it at the default nine ounces to a pound because uh, most of the books that I'm um, that I'm shipping um, they are going to be less than a pound. Um, so yeah, so there's that. And then I'm going to enter the address here um, and enter all that information. Sorry, I'm doing this. Okay. And the next step is to save and close. So I'll do that. Then this should automatically, you should see that uh, in your um, listing there. So then I'm going to hit print, which pops up this, which is pay and print. So I'm going to click on pay and print there. And it will either use funds that I already have in my PayPal account. Uh, to pay for this, or it will um, deduct it from the bank account that I have um, connected with my PayPal account. So once the payment is processed, um, this screen should pop up. One thing I was going to show you, I forgot to mention, um, I love that um, the media mail shipping label on PayPal includes the delivery confirmation. It's only 23 cents, um, and that is usually um, a little more expensive um, at, at the post office, so I like that it's um, included, and um, you can track your media mail shipping uh, package that way. So this will pop up. Sorry for that little rabbit uh, rabbit trail we chased. So I'll hit print one page. Okay, it's going to send it to my printer, and then um, you know, it tells you it's being sent. And then I always wait to click OK to make sure that my label has printed. So it is being sent now. And then it will print. So then I just uh, use packing tape, tape the label to the package, and I'm good to go. So I hope that's helpful as you um, need to ship various books using media mail for your Eshorn business. Thanks, ladies.